Hi there, we're here in Centerville, Maryland at Corsica River Mental Health. And we're here with John Pulaskin, the executive director of the agency, and Lee Brooke, the chairman of the board. How are you today? It's oh, fine. Fine. Thanks. How are you? Good. Good. <laughs> and as you know, I'm excited about being here. I, I just think it's a great agency. You have a lot to offer, and um, we'd like to find out more about you. Is that okay? That's that's why we're here. <laughs> all right. So, John, tell me all about Corsica River Mental Health. Okay. Well, we uh, we started in 2009 in response to the need for additional services in Queen Anne's County. Mm -hmm. um, we have um, licensed mental health professionals, we have psych nurse practitioners, we have MD psychiatrist um, who provide uh, individual group and family therapy to um, anyone mm -hmm. that needs our services, whether you're from Queen Anne's County or other surrounding counties. Mm -hmm. um, of course, we take all insurances, Medicaid, Medicaid Medicare, private insurance, um, self-pay. Um, we also have a sliding scale for folks who don't have insurance. So we don't want to turn anyone away that needs services. Um, most recently, we've gotten uh, started in substance use disorder treatment services. Uh, I think a lot of folks know there's a, there's a lot of issues going on in our community related to people using opioids and other drugs and uh, so we've established those services recently and uh, what we'd like to do is get into medication assisted treatment also but it takes a little time to kind of develop that okay. uh, so basically in a nutshell that's what we do and we serve folks here uh, Corsica River also has a location in St. Michael's and Cambridge and then we've just recently with the substance use disorder treatment services they're in Centerville, St. Michael's, and Cambridge, but we're also establishing them in Chestertown, Denton, and Easton in conjunction with another agency. So um, we're just, again, trying to meet the need that's out there. Well, Lee, tell me all about the Board of Directors. Are, are, you, are you guys fun? That's the first thing. We're about. fun. There are five <laughs> of us. Okay. I tell you, when you get involved with um, the mental health services, mm -hmm. which um, Corsica River Mental Health Services is a subsidiary of Crossroads. Okay. And when you get involved with this community, you stay. I've been here for 28 years off and on, uh, originally working in day programs, uh, being on both the F Crossroads Foundation and regular board, doing fundraisers. And everybody who works for Crossroads feels that way. It's such a, and now the Corsica River Mental Health health services since they've been here now for seven years um, they are such a caring or I mean really caring organization they're absolutely great with their assessments and their professional counseling and um, I really am in retirement and just didn't want to be involved anymore but I came on board and I was on the board for a couple of years and now I find myself president. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just a fantastic organization. Yes. And John really knows what he's doing. He's really grown with the need mm -hmm. and um, that's about all I have to say. Oh, I think it's great. <laughs> I think it's great. Well, thank you all for letting us come. And can you tell the public how they can contact you? Uh, sure. I actually, actually forgot that sure. we, we also provide services in the school system. Oh, okay. So they, um, in, with the Memorandum of Understanding with the Board of Education, mm -hmm. school staff might identify a child who, who might benefit from services, and then they'll talk to the parent mm -hmm. to see if they're interested, and then the parent can contact us. Uh, we have a registration process mm -hmm. first, and it's really any hours we're open. Okay. So um, you can check our website for hours of operation, and uh, when person registers for services, that's to make sure that we have you know all the T's crossed and I's mm -hmm. dotted too, and the person works out with an appointment to see the therapist for the initial assessment. Um, and we try to get that done within five business days, really, so we try to avoid any kind of wait list. Mm -hmm. Uh, or delay in people getting access to the services. Um, to contact us, I mean, our, cell, our uh, office number is 410-758-2211. Um, or we're at 120 Banjo Lane, Centerville, and you can walk in. 
<laughs> That's a great time. Okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, yes, you one can. More thing. I just want to say that our, we're looking for new board members mm -hmm. for mental health services. So um, if you think you have something to offer, give us a call. <laughs> we'll do. We'll do. Thank you both so much. It's been a joy being here today. And it really is great knowing that there is help there, you know, that, that and it's not far. It's not far. So, you know, we really thank you for letting us come and, and hear about the organization today. Thanks very much, Renee. All right. Thank you. All right. So if you feel that you are not understood and you need some help, it, something is not right, you just don't feel quite yourself, come on in, register, come to Corsica River. They're a wonderful organization. There are a lot of people here to help you, to listen to you, and help you feel better. So this is Renee with QAC TV today. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.